Bro, where the fuck is Nino? I'm gonna kill him. I just sat and I've been sitting in jail all day. I feel like I'm in jail right now. <laughs> My patience is so thin right now. <laughs> I gotta get this guy on some cocaine, speed him up. Oh, there's that Ferrari. Damn, look at this car. What's going on, Mr. Chang? Oh, is this the one that was auctioned off? Mm-hmm. So you bought it, like bought it eight huh? months ago. Yeah. <laughs> I was oh, sorry, wondering what second. this bad boy was, boy. Hey, what's going on? Uh, no, he doesn't need to know my name. Just say, uh, you know, next time learn a couple manas. Uh, don't like dump his body or anything. Just like, you know, just hurt him. I heard consuming the fresh is a good way to get rid of a body. Um, uh, <laughs> wait, consuming the flesh? Is that what you said? Right. If you eat it, there's nowhere to find where it went. What the fuck? Like chop it up or some shit? Yeah, chop it up, eat it, grow it. I don't think I've ever tried cannibalism before. Or if we think about it, how could they find evidence if there is none? That's true. Well, see, that's why some people like to give it to shocks. Because, like, if you cut it, cut it uh, into little pieces and then just kind of, like, spread it in the water, the shocks are going to eat it up. Exactly. And then there's nothing left. Maybe alligators. Get a little alligator pond at your house. There's alligator. I like that. Allig they can probably... I bet an alligator can, like, completely just swallow oh, yeah. an entire human being. Get a big uh, bowl of conscrucky. You can eat the whole thing. They want a snack. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, all that um, stuff is great. It's very really great. I've got... I've got, um... i got something for you. Let's, uh... Do you want to go up the ladder? Yeah, let's go up the ladder. I need a little work. I've been fucking locked up. My bones are stiff. Oh, what happened? <laughs> Whoa. This dude, Rami. You remember Rami? Yep. He's over here drunk the fuck out in the car. I'm like, Whoa, you can't be doing that. And he was hogging on the fucking cocaine. Next thing you know, this dude sec. jumps out the car and we go to jail. What the fuck? Oh, thank you so much. 88? Okay. Um, I will drop off a payment soon. All right. Um, so I spoke to Vinny about this earlier today. Um, but my understanding is that information may not come to you soon enough, uh, due to some, uh, business Vinny is working on. Right, um, right. Let me, uh, I'm gonna send this over your way. Who's this? Is this your guy? No. I don't know who that is. It's local fucking riot, looks like. Better rob a car, is it, huh? Oh, you think so? Who's an IMP car? This is about a jack your shit. He's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Body swimmer from the top of Hey, you stupid cunt! What? <laughs> you looking at Jack Cars over here? Huh? What you doing over here, you scumbag? Nothing, just looking around, you know. How about we take that boot and shove it up your fucking yeah. ass, bro? Looks like you're casing up some vehicles or something. Hey, you know, uh, there's some good stuff around here. Is that right? Sounds like we're about to get into some shit. Let me look. Shit, these just pop off. I'm I'm dry, pal. So that guy definitely texted. Oh, hoo -hoo. who is that broad? Let's go say hello. Oh, hey, 
guess. Hola. I, I, I can't hear you at all, sir. I was going to oh, say hello, but oh, I'm going to say ma? goodbye. Um, oh, you, me, I'm going to chill over here. Hey, do you want to you wanna check out my car? Yeah, let's check out your car. Let's check out your car. All right. Yeah, I don't know. You know, I'm pretty sure anymore. it almost looks like that woman had uh, her mother or father must be like a horse or something. Yeah, very horse rank. Have yeah, the key? You have a tuna chip on you? Yeah, of course, I got a tuna chip. This thing tuned is something else. What you tuning this bad boy? Uh, 10, 10, 10, 5, 2. Ready to bro, boys? I right, told me... people disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you ain't wrong. You know, you know damn well that guy's either still in a car or they were following one of us. Oh, for sure. He's a straight up fucking scumbag. Oh, this moves, bro. It does. The turning on this, oh. For so obvious. it's like 180. It doesn't have illegals on it yet. Um, it's got all the Benny's upgrades. It hits 180, like untuned. I think about 220 tuned. So the Regal's on there. You going about 240, pal? You think so? Yeah, 235, 240. Ooh. All right, where we at? Um, anywhere, anywhere uh private, because I need to uh show you something. Uh, let me grab the document. I'm gonna be like uh, a second here. I'll end it up on my phone. We got a nice little house we can go in over here. Oh, perfect. Yeah, follow me. Careful, big jump. I know you're getting low. There you go. <laughs> oh, it's a nice little spot. That's a little place we can go in right over here. Wrong about the old thing. Ugh. All right, just uh, pull out this document in my bag. document Has uh Vinny given you a document at all today? You showed me uh, I think it was some images. Um, you know, the vault was on it, right from beta. Oh, oh. Fantastic, fantastic. So you already got the uh the Yeah, I can pictures. get this open. All right, beautiful. Uh when you have it up, uh let me know and then I'm gonna sort of go through it with you real quick. All right, got it. All right. 
So, um, there's a client of mine that is uh, looking to acquire uh, some information. Okay, okay. Um, as you know, um, the Pacific Bank, uh, what is it, the Pacific Standard or whatever the fuck, down in the city, um, it gets hit very, very often. Um, but more or less, you know, you go in there, you got a couple, uh, you know, get a couple money bags, whatever you get out. They don't really give a fuck. Cause you make what? Like you take, uh, you, you get what out of there? You get like 300, maybe 200, 400, 300, yeah. 400. Yeah. It's peanuts to them. They Not hit much. up the insurance company. They give them the money back. They don't give a fuck. Reality of the matter is there's some better shit inside some of those, uh, some of those safe, some of those safes. Right, right. Um, the means by which, um, you normally can't just use a uh, thermite or whatever, extra reinforced, and therefore there's going to be a little uh, package that uh will allow you to crack it open all the way. Oh, we're talking about a fucking razor. You're talking about uh C4. Oh, explosives. Okay. Mm. So this is going to be more than just a fucking bank robbery. That's right. We have to blow this bitch up pretty much. That's right. Now, in there, uh, Intel has shown that um, this particular thing, um, specifically a USB device, is going to be sitting in one of these cases. All right. Once okay. each one of these locks has been broken, as you would normally hit it, Right. Uh, and you've acquired all those things. You plant it, you explode it, and you should find yourself a little USB device. Oh, hell yeah. Um, once it has been retrieved, you need to get out of there. Now, based on my understanding, um, you know, sometimes these kind of, uh, these jobs, folks tend to, let's just say, stick around, maybe take out the cops or whatever. Right. This is going to be a little different. I would need you guys, you're going to want to get out, whatever means necessary, helicopter, tuna, car, whatever it is. Right. Because that's not where the difficulty begins. Okay, I got it with a plan to get out of this smoothly. Now, the moment that USB is acquired, you can fully expect that the, uh, the, the managers of that bank and those who are interested in this USB device are going to find out. Or it's going to get out. There's probably going to be some calls that they make to the department. Right. So the heat's already going to be turned up. And because of that, there's going to be a one-hour window estimated as to when these guys are going to try to turn off that USB. Now, they're not going to turn it off remotely. But this USB device is going to act to some, like, online, like, fucking nerdy shit. They're going to try to turn off the connection to it. Because as far as they, they're concerned right now, this thing is safe. Once they know it's not safe... They're going to do whatever they can to prevent this device from being activated. These scumbags. These scumbags indeed. Within that hour window, once you've lost the heat, you have to get the Life Invader. In Life Invader, there's a particular terminal that you're going to see in that photograph um, that the USB device needs to be connected to. Mm, okay, okay. That will begin a download process that will take roughly 20 minutes. Um, but before that can be done, the mainframe, there should be a picture on there, yep, there needs to be taken down. Okay, That's okay. also going to be blown up. Now, here's the thing. The moment that shit's blown up, the, the guys who are looking after this USB device, they are very likely and almost positively going to connect the dots and are going to start making sure that something is done about it. It wouldn't surprise me if the cops come in with like class tools, their SWAT rifles or whatever fucking overpowered gun they got to bust their way through. So okay. it's going to be sort of like a holdout and then bust out sort of scenario. Right, right. You feel me? Now, Once the download is completed, you get out of there. Well, the good news is there's a lot of factors here, but luckily mm. I have an engineer on my side 
This man Good. can take out that chef room, no problem, Bob. Perfect. <laughs> That's perfect. And I actually own a couple of real estate in the area, right next to Rifle Beta, so that could come in handy. Really? Wu Chang Records, placed right across the street from uh, Rifle right Beta with a great grand rooftop shaped like a castle. That's good. Now, I would not hold any punches on this. Oh, hell at all. Nah. And if 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 the cops arrive, whatever's all hands on deck. You know what I mean? Like whatever needs to be done, you do it because they're coming in hard. Oh, we coming at least in hard. I expect them to. If it ends up that they don't show up, well, fuck. Uh, well, that wouldn't surprise me either. <laughs> quite frankly. Better for us, Paul. Exactly. Um, any questions? Oh, can this be done tomorrow? Oh, 100% this can be done tomorrow. I got surprise coming in through different support chains, things coming together. Mm. This job will be done. Perfect, perfect. Now, um, any uh, of the supplies required? Um, Vinny is, uh, I'll make sure it comes your way. Right, I'm gonna assume you guys got the uh, C4 handled for us? Uh, any, everything and anything you need. Okay, uh, it's far. gonna be sorted out. All right, perfect. Now, is there uh, any type of, uh, you know, compensation in this job here? Um, I'm looking at about 200K. Ooh, baby, gonna give me a new fucking mm -hmm. get up. And then, uh, anything that, uh, you know, all the other stuff that comes out of it, all yours. Oh, hell yeah. Sounds like a vault robbery press a little extra on top. That's what I'm talking about. Absolutely. All right. Um, Let's start driving. This uh, closed environments get me a little nervous. Oh, it's I don't know who's like got like me. supersonic heat ears, you know, hearing through doors and shit. Yeah, this is Big D's party with, yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah, so most people Not don't a bad even spot. pay attention to it. You know, it's just Big D. <laughs> oh, uh, one other thing. Um, at uh, Life Invader, no hostages. All right. Rest people to Re worry about. That's right. Because the problem is that if a hostage were to be taken, uh, they may see a couple things. They may end up squ squealing, you know. Yeah, uh, we would have to fucking kill them. More dirt right. on our hands. Exactly. Exactly. You can't trust the hostages, bro. No, you really can't. Because they'll cry to you right there. But as soon as you're gone... That's all out the window. And of course, this goes without saying, um, if the client's happy, I uh, very much expect uh, more things uh, more things like this to make its way into the city. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Between us, he's kind of a cunt. Oh, they usually are. <laughs> how's, uh, how's life been? Oh, it's been great, making big money, making moves, securing uh, power on the streets. You know how it goes out there. That's what I'm talking about. That's all it's about, right? It's all it's about, baby. Family, power, and money. Family, power, and money. What about pussy? That's got to be on the list. Oh, you know, it just depends on what season it is. Well, like Valentine's Day or like, yeah, what do you maybe mean? you want to switch it up. Oh, you know, want a little pussy. like man pussy or something? Exactly, exactly. Fair enough. I told you. Yeah, where we account for the seasons? Maybe it's spring, summer, winter. So tomorrow, any time frame on this, or just uh, whenever we're ready? Uh, whenever you're ready. Um, whenever you're ready. Yeah. Uh, I'd say, uh, if you have an idea, like, I, I'd imagine you do it anytime between, like, 8 and midnight, I imagine. Yeah, it'll be done within that time frame is what I was thinking. Perfect. Perfect. Um, as to any curiosities, the USB is going to be in there. Um, oh, what the fuck? Where'd your cargo? 
Motherfuckers jacked my shit, bro. He did, didn't I he? I knew that dude was a fucking scum. What the fuck? Why is he? Do you, did you do you know that guy? Never seen him before. What the fuck would he be following you just to take your shit? Who was that guy? Yeah, the fucking horse. What the fuck was that? What's going on? The guys did mean enough to have sex? I mean, possibly, but why would they? They weren't flagging your car down just to steal it. Ah, uh, them scumbags! Well, I got a car in the impound lot I could use. I'll bring you over. I don't think they. I mean, they could have been chopping cars. Stop an ATM real quick. Uh, you need money? Yeah, that shit got police impounded. Be enough. My man got a couple of locks on him. Always. You never know when you need it. You know what I mean? All right. All right. So, um, I'll give you a call tomorrow. Let you know, you know, when we're getting this kicked off and I'll keep you updated. All right. Uh, I may not be around, but, uh, I will make sure that, uh, my associate Passes all the information over. All right, people. Fuck. Yep. Whenever you're ready, um, you don't even need to let me know. Yeah, dinner would. Uh, my wife said you can come over for dinner tomorrow, but uh, was that motherfucker here the whole time? I don't even know. I didn't did see it. From? Oh, I think he might have been like in the garage. Anyways, all right. We'll be in touch. Give me a call if you need anything. All right. Take care. That's gonna be so fucking awesome tomorrow, chat. Well, sounds like we're gonna be fighting not only cops, but actual people too. Pretty much hinted at. Don't give him no chances. Fuck it. Fuck everybody up. Trained killer mode. You know what I'm saying? So while the boys are in jail, should we go to Life Meter and scope this shit out? Since uh, I mean, we got the smartest people in this fucking chat. <laughs> 